What's up, Pineapples? Welcome back to my channel. So today I have a haul for you. I'm really excited because today I am partnering with Boohoo for this video. This is my first time trying out their clothes, so I'm really excited. I'm also happy because they have a plus section, so that means more sizes for more people, and I'm all about that. Now, I know I haven't done a haul in a while, and I know you guys appreciate that, so I'm really happy to be doing this. I am a size 14, and I'm 5'9", just in case. I'll make sure to go through the clothes and let you know how it fits, and maybe what might be tight or loose, or maybe long, or if you are short, so I'll make Make sure to explain everything because I know you guys also appreciate that. Also, go ahead and check out Boohoo down below. I'll make sure to definitely link everything that I try on today in case you guys are interested. Go ahead and check them out and shop their new in section. They definitely have a whole variety of clothes from casual tops to more going out tops to dresses to pants to all of that. So I'm super excited. I have a variety of different shirts and dresses and jackets and a trend that I am like super excited to show you because it is coming back. So now let's get on with this haul and I'll link everything down below. The first t-shirt I have is the glow up tee. Now I know back to school is coming up really soon for some people. So I figured this would be really good for anybody who wants to be just more casual and comfortable in class. So I thought this was really cute. Now I did get a size large. Now if you want to maybe go down a size because you want it a little bit more fitted, you can, but as you can see, it is pretty loose. So I probably could have gone down to a medium or what's really good about this is this can be like more comfortable and then you don't have to like you know have anything too tight so I definitely like this t-shirt you guys know I have like a more like casual vibe I'm either like super casual or I like to be super girly um, I'm kind of like not really in between I'm like either casual or girly so I figured this was like perfect just throw on with some jeans which I'm wearing right now what you can always do is just maybe like tie it to the side if you want to or maybe do like a cute little knot in the front and then just wear it with like bands or something like that but I thought this tee was like really cute just because I like like the casual sleeve it's not too tight um, again if you wanted a little bit more fitted I would downsize just a little because I feel like it's running just a little bit big but it's definitely comfortable and cozy so if this is your vibe then this is awesome now next up I have this jacket now I wanted to kind of just pair it with this shirt just because it's gonna go and this one is also in a size 14 and this is a leather look quilted biker jacket. Now I really like this because I like the detail on the back and also the front. It's super, super soft. And then as you can see, there's the zipper right there with silver hardware and it doesn't go straight down. It goes like asymmetrical a little bit. It's like more on the side. So I really like items like this just because it kind of dresses up an outfit as well instead of it being so casual. So let's try this baby on and I am 5'9". So it hits like at that perfect length. It's not too long, but it's not too short. Uh, the sleeves are really nice when I like bring them down. They're a little bit long, but once I lift up my arms, they're perfect length. You want to make sure that you don't get like sleeves that are too short because then it's going to look like it's almost flooding. So even though they may look long right here, once you start doing things and lifting up your arms, it's like perfect length. This one feels like super soft. I mean, I really like it. Also, you have some hardware on the side in case you wanna open this up. This kind of loosens up the sleeve a little bit and then when you zipper it up, it kind of tightens it up. So that's kind of cool. I've never seen a jacket like, well, at least my other jacket that I have that looks like this doesn't do that. I don't know, I think this one's like really cute. And then the pockets, sometimes I feel like when you have zippers on the side, they're like fake pockets. Have you guys ever seen that? But you can actually put your hand in there and I really prefer a real pocket because sometimes it's like, it tricks you. It has like the zipper and you go like this and there's no real pocket. So you got some real pockets. <laughs> And then here it is zipped up just so you can see. I still have some space. I really like this kind of outlet because I feel like if it goes all the way down, it's like, like you're too like cinched in and I feel like this kind of gives you leeway to be comfortable still. I mean, I'm not one to really zip up my jackets because I live in Southern California. It's really nice and warm, but I just wanted to show you what it looks like when it is zipped up. But personally, I like it like this. And if you're not into like the whole jacket look, I also picked up the chunky knitted belted boyfriend. Now I feel like so many things for fall are already coming up. I'm not gonna lie, I'm a little bit sad, but you gotta go with the seasons. And so I planned ahead and I love this color. This color is in toffee and I think it's just like beautiful and neutral. I'm a big time fan of like knitted, like cable knit sweaters. And then this one also has a belt. If you wanna go for like a more cozy vibe, I think this is awesome. I mean, if you wanna be, I don't know, I feel like the jacket like brings it up a notch for like nighttime, but this is like more daytime appropriate, I guess you can say, or just like more cozy. I guess it just depends on the vibe. But let me just do this. And you guys, today is a nice warm day, so I'm definitely feeling the heat. 
but I think it's really cute. I mean, again, I'm never one to like truly tie it. Like I'll maybe like leave a tie in the back. Watch, I'll do a bow in the back, but I never really tie my cardigans like in the front. I mean, you could do that or you can kind of just let it go. Let's see, just like more cash, you know, just like this. And I really like it. And then you can also wear it without the belt. It's not like you have to wear it with the belt. And it goes really nice and long. So it is a really nice long cardigan. I really like this. I like how it's just like more relaxed on the sleeves and I just feel like it's super nice and cozy and perfect for when fall comes. Or again, if you're like in a colder climate because like I said, I'm in Southern California so today it is warm but I definitely love myself a good cardigan, especially like this color, I don't know. This is like my go-to for like fall time or whenever I wear a sweater. I mean, I can totally see myself marinating in this because once I love a sweater, I wear it to death. So then I went ahead and picked this and I feel like this kind of hits like the medium of the categories, right? It's just like a regular, just like little jacket. This one's called the Pocket Front Contrast Lined Bomber Jacket. Again, it's a bomber jacket. I couldn't think of the name, but I feel like it like hits like that happy medium. And then right on the inside, it has like a fun pop of color, but once you wear it, you're not going to see that. Let's bring this over. Let's see what this baby looks like. Oh yeah, this is like perfect. It's like right in the middle. It's not too warm. Um, the the faux leather jacket is a much thicker material, so it's gonna keep you nice and warm. So I like the olive green with like the black trim. I think it'll match a lot. And then let's zip it up so you guys can see what it looks like right here. It's just like super cash. And then do we have real pocket? We have real pockets, people. I picked another white t-shirt. I don't know, I feel like I don't have like a lot of white. I really like the sleeve uh, detail. This one is the eyelash lace t-shirt. I love the sleeves, I think it's so cute. It's just like different than like the typical plain tee, like the ones that I usually wear, it kind of like umps it up. This is a size large, again, it kind of has like the same feel as the other glow up t-shirt, like it's a little bit more on like the loose side, so if you want something a little bit more fitting, you definitely can go for like a medium in case you are like the same size as me or you wear a size large. And I love how the sleeves aren't tight because sometimes I feel like some sleeves just kind of like cinch in, and I really like how they're kind of giving some leeway on the sizing like this so I think it's super comfortable and I'm really happy like I want it in black I have a dress for you oh my gosh I was getting so hot so this is the v-neck swing dress and I don't know does this tie in the front I think it ties in the back <laughs> this is wrong Just kidding, but I'm so happy to be wearing a dress. No lie, I was getting really hot in those pants. But again, this is, yeah, that's much better. So this is the V-neck swing dress. Now again, I am 5'9". Let me show you where it's hitting. Here is the danger zone right here. And then we have some leeway. It's not too short, that's for sure. Um, it is a swing dress, so it's not gonna be like cinched in. It's more, you know, like a swing dress. <laughs> uh, definitely just have like some give to it. Um, the only problem with me is that I personally don't kind of go for this side. I just wanted to try it out, but the material is so soft is because I have a larger chest. So when you have a larger chest, it t tends to bring it out more. Um, so I don't know. I feel like I'm floating right here, but the thing is, is sometimes I don't really care. Like sometimes I do care and sometimes I don't. That's why I wanted to get it just so I have something like more casual and like relaxed, but I usually don't care. Like say for instance, like I have the cardigan on, let me go get it. Like, like if I'm going for like a cozy mood, which is the reason why I picked this because I'm sure some of you are like, well, if you don't like that style on you, why are you wearing it? But say like I have like this cardigan on and say, say like I had like some boots, like this is perfect, like a perfect like cozy outfit with like a dress. And then when I have this, see, you can't really tell. You can't really tell because see, this is like here and it's kind of like disrupting the whole flow and it's more like a whole outfit and it just goes but I think this is really cute with the cardigan and also the dress. So I think this is good. I mean, I really like it, but like I said, I'm one where I kind of get iffy. Like sometimes I like the outfit and sometimes I don't on me just because of the chest, but I really like the sleeve. It's very casual, it's very nice and loose. And again, the material is really impressing me because I'm like super picky on how materials look and feel, and this feels super, super soft. So there's the tie at the neck right there. And here's, and there was the back. Again, you can always like maybe belt it up, but then sometimes when you belt it up, 
it kind of makes it short so I have tried stuff like that but I usually what I'll do is I'll usually just like pair with the cardigan and then like I like the whole entire thing but overall it's super super comfortable and I love this one like very nice and flowy and it doesn't feel cheap plus I'm really happy to be out of jeans Whew. The tie goes in the back and I absolutely love this dress. It's super, super soft. Again, the material is really impressing me with this brand because like I said, this is my first time trying out this brand. I, and I would definitely let you guys know what I don't like and what I like or what I think needs to be different. But again, the stitching is really nice. It doesn't look cheap. It feels super, super soft and it's not too short, at least in my opinion. Here, I'll back up. I don't want to hit the table. See? So I am 5'9", so if you are shorter, this is obviously going to be okay for you. So my thing is, is even though I picked out this shift dress, like, I don't really like how I have a larger chest and then it kind of flows out like this. I mean, you can put a belt, but then that tends to kind of make it too short on me at least. I know some other people can get away with it. Uh, sometimes there are dresses that are longer and then I can put like a little waist belt, um, but most of the time that's not really the case. But the way that I like to kind of break it up because I like like the comfort of a swing dress is, watch, I'll show you. Like, say for instance, I have this cardigan that I got. It basically kind of like breaks up like the whole like flow of not having any shape uh, just because it makes like the whole outfit cozy so say I have like this dress on and I can have like little booties or like thigh-high boots or anything like that I think this kind of like breaks it up because you don't really see that flow because you do have the cardigan so it just kind of like makes it into like a whole I don't know like it just goes I hope you guys understand what I'm saying um, because you guys know I'm always big on kind of like cinching in my waist showing shape uh, not really hiding my curves just because I think um, you should embrace your curves and you should really show like, you know, some shape and all of that. So I really like things that like cinch in. Um, I probably could do a belt on this, I feel like, or I could always do like a belt and say like it have stockings underneath and then it wouldn't really like make that big of like a difference because it is a little bit shorter. But overall, I think this is super cute. And I think the little tie in the back is cute. Like say for instance, if you happen to have like your hair up, then you have like that little detail in the back. My earrings really don't match, so kind of ignore those, but I am so excited about this because I feel like Leopard is totally going to be trending for fall season and winter. I feel like I've seen so many different pieces with Leopard coming out, and I'm a big time fan of Leopard, but I just never really wore it because, I don't know, it really wasn't in at the time, and I'm so excited because now it is finally in, and I'm obsessed with this dress just because it has like the perfect amount of Leopard. Like I think this little trim is so freaking cute. I like how the arms are more fitted on this and opposed to the swing dress, this one does come right to the chest and like cinches it in, like how I love. And the dress is long enough so when I bend over, uh, I'm, you're not gonna see like the goodies or anything like that. That's how long it is. It's definitely right to my knee so it's not too short at all. I think this is so cute. It looks so cute with like booties and stuff but my favorite part of the dress is like the leopard trim. I just think this part is so cute. All right guys, so I went ahead and got another leopard dress. Like I said, I am so excited for like the leopard trend to come back. But what I had to do was put a little black tank top. I do have a bandeau, but I can't find it right now. I'm pretty sure it's in my hamper to wash, but this one, you definitely have to wear a bandeau or else it's just like, hello, the goodies are out. Nice to meet you. Um, so this is pretty low cut. I don't remember what the model was wearing, if she was wearing a bandeau, but I don't think she was. Um, so at least for me, for this cut, um, I really like it, except you do obviously have to have something unless you just want to have everything out, then go ahead. But I really like how it cinches in at the waist. And let me show you the bottom right here. It's not too short. And then I'll show you the back. Now I will say out of all the materials, this one probably is like the most rough. It's more just like a plain cotton and it's not as um, soft feeling as all the other ones. Super low cut. So you just got to wear like a bandeau or like a little cami underneath. Oh, you can also wear like a little lace one. I think that would look really cute. So next up I have this dress, but I just wanted to show you this really quick. Boohoo, when you order their stuff, I've never seen this before, but it says, uh, do not remove unless you are satisfied with this garment. Returns will not be accepted if this tag has been removed removed. Well, I just tried on the dress because it doesn't really manipulate like how I wear it and I actually really like it. So I'm just going to let that go. But just an FYI, in case you're ordering from them, 
don't remove that tag off the bat read it and yeah but look at this dress look how cute this is okay so it's a low cut dress again um i really like it it has like these little i don't know if you guys see it but they're like these little dots like this little puff thingies i don't know what you call it but they're definitely out there they're like 3d they're like I don't know, like little cotton balls all around, but it looks cute. It's like a really cute detail and it goes all the way to the sleeve. I love the bell sleeve. I think it just adds a little something. You guys know I love to fly. But the dress itself is nice and thick, so it's not gonna be see-through. It's not gonna show any undergarments because I'm also big on that. I don't like it when things are too like thin down, down below and then you guys can like see like your thong or your underwear, or whatever you're wearing underneath. Um, but I absolutely love this one. I think this is so cute. So now I have like this really fun piece. It's like really nice and bright. Again, with the tag, just letting you know. It fits me, so I plan on keeping this. This is like, um, it's not like, it's three quarter sleeve, right? Yeah, three quarter sleeve. Now the material almost feels like silk, but it's not silk. Um, I feel like this might be a material that you have to be careful with because it is kind of wrinkled right now. So just make sure like you steam it and stuff like that because it is a super soft material. Um, I would just be careful and really put low heat, I can tell, um, but it's done really nicely again. I really like the dress, just something like, I've never had like a red dress, so I figured, hey, let's like get out of the comfort zone. And I think, it, I don't know, I just think it's like really fun just because I wanna try out different things. I think it looks really nice and I love how it can be like a casual dress to a night dress. Like I said, I like two furs, so I can put like sandals on, just have my hair like this and we will be fine. Or if I'm like, okay, it's gonna be date night, throw on some heels, have like a cute little bag, um, still have my hair like this, <laughs> and then we'll be good to go the coral red I guess you can say but I just like the color because it's nice and bright and I don't know just I like the color it makes me happy so it's super thick especially down below because you're not gonna be able to see any undergarments like I said do not like thin materials down below I hate that because it don't show like the belly button and the thong and it's just not my deal so yeah, I really like this. All right guys, so next up we have the frill dress. I was like, frill, frill dress. Now I will say in on the site, it looked more of like a blush. And to me, this looks more like a warm taupe. Now I will say off the bat, this is one of the dresses out of all of them that I chose runs much larger in size. This one feels like a size 16. Um, but I feel like the dress doesn't really complement my body. It's just like floating all around. Right, so I feel like out of all of the ones, this one just doesn't flatter my personal body type. I'm sure this would look amazing on someone else, but for me personally, I don't really care the way that it looks on me, but it is a really nice flowy dress. Like I can see someone totally rocking this. I'm gonna keep this baby on. Again, do not cut this if you plan on returning or anything like that, but um, overall, I mean, hey, not every single thing that you're gonna, that you're gonna order, you're gonna love, so that's why they have returns, which is always awesome. And yeah, but this one, it's just, I don't know it's not for me I feel like it just doesn't fit me right and it doesn't do anything for me but I think it is cute like I feel like this could look cute on like a lot of other people just not me and for my final top like I said I absolutely love leopard and this top I am obsessed with it's actually a wraparound top so you take the strings and you tie it underneath and then this one wraps around and it ties right here so you have two different ties I love the sleeves I love how it cinches in the waist I think it looks so cute. Like I love this portion right here. I'm just like brings you right in, but then it goes out. So it's like super, super comfortable. This is a low cut top. So again, you can always put like a black bandeau or whatever you feel comfortable, comfortable with, but I absolutely love it. I think this one is super cute. All right, final so that is it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed. This was my very last piece that I picked out. I'm really happy with my haul. I think everything worked out just except that one dress, like I said, it just didn't really like fit my body type. Other than that, Everything else is amazing. The material was really nice. The stitching was really nice and nothing looked cheap and everything was at a really good affordable price. I'll make sure to link everything down below. Go ahead and comment and let me know down below what your favorite piece was. I don't know, I always like seeing like what you guys like. So I'll make sure to link Boohoo down below. Like I said, go ahead and shop their new in section. I think you guys will be really happy with the variety of stuff they had. Like I said, they have from casual to nighttime stuff to everything to nice blouses to casual t-shirts to pants to jeans you name it they got it so i'll make sure to link everything down below i love you guys so much i hope you guys enjoy today's haul and i'll see you beautiful people in the next one Mwah.